Let's take a look at the ordering numbers questions. All of these questions are non-calculator. Question number one, put them in order, smallest to largest. So the key thing is just to check, do they all have the same number of digits? So here we've got three digit numbers, but there's one two digit number. So the two digit, digit number is the smallest. So we'll start our list with 89. With the rest, we're just comparing the first numbers. So five, one, nine, six. Well, one is lower than nine and six and five. So one, seven, four comes next. Five is lower than six and nine. So five, eight, four comes next. Six is less than nine. So six, 20, nine, eight, one. Smallest to largest, we're gonna start with the two digit number, which is 15. For the remaining three digit numbers, look at the first digit, one, two, five, five. So one is the smallest. So one, nine, nine comes next, followed by two, one, two. And we've got the two, five, uh, two numbers beginning with five to contend with at the end. So here we just need to look at the next digit along. Here it's a five, here it's a seven, five is less than seven. So 550 is smaller than 578, which is the largest number on this particular list. Question three, they're all three digit numbers. So the largest um, is gonna be the one which has the uh, largest first number. So we've got eight, six, four, two, four. So eight is bigger than six, four, two, and four. So eight, six, six is the largest number. Six is bigger than four, bigger than two, bigger than four. So 680 comes next. We've got two numbers beginning with the four, so we need to look at the second digit, which is an eight and a two. Eight is bigger than two, so four, eight, seven comes next, followed by four, two, five, and finally, 294. So largest to smallest, so they're all three digits. So let's look at the first digit, five, five, two, seven, four. Of those numbers, seven is the biggest. So seven, eight, one is the largest of all five numbers. Uh, five, five, two, four, five is biggest, but we've got two fives. So we need to look at the second digit, three versus one. Three is bigger than one. So five, three, six comes next, followed by five, one, one. And two, three, six, four, five, zero, well, four is bigger than two. So 450 comes next. And the smallest number is therefore two, three, six. Smallest to largest, notes here, we've got four digit numbers and a three digit number. So a three digit number will always be uh, smaller than a four digit number. So 304 is the smallest number. The four digit numbers begin with seven, four, two, four. So the smallest is the one that begins with the two since two is less than four and seven. Four is less than seven. So the next smallest is either 4290 or 4195. Since they both start with a four, we'll look at the second digit, which is a two versus a one. Well, one is smaller than two. So the next number is 4195 followed by 4290, so the 7228 is the largest number. Smallest to largest, well, we've got a three digit number amongst some four digit numbers, so this is the smallest. Now just compare the, um, the, the four, four digit numbers, which begin with a four, nine, six, and nine. So the smallest will be the one beginning with a four, since four is less than six and nine, so four, three, six, nine comes next. Six is less than nine and nine. So six, two, two, three is the next smallest. And now we're comparing nine, two, eight, six, and nine, seven, nine, nine. Both begin with nine. So let's look at the second digit. We've got a seven and a two, or two is less than seven. So therefore nine, two, eight, six is smaller in value than nine, seven, nine, nine, which is the largest number on the list. Question seven, largest to smallest. They're all four digit numbers. So let's take a look at the value of the first digit, which is a five, nine, five, nine, three. So nine is the largest number there. So we're comparing nine, two, three, eight and nine, four, nine, six. They both begin with a nine. So let's check out the second digit. We've got a two and a four. Four is bigger than two. So nine, four, nine, six is the largest. Next largest is therefore nine, two, three, eight. The remaining numbers begin with five, five, and three. So three is lower than the five. So actually this is gonna be, definitely gonna be the smallest of the number. So um, that's the three, eight, six. Sorry, I've crossed it off. Can't see what it says anymore. Six, six, or is it six, eight? Anyway, this is the smallest number here. Um, 
So we now need, just need to compare the 5013 and the 5435. Um, they both begin with a five, so we need to look at the second digit, which is a zero and a four. Four is larger than zero, so the next largest is gonna be five, four, three, five, followed by five, zero, one, three. Question eight, largest to smallest, they're all four digits, so let's just look at the value of the first digit, two, eight, six, one, and four. Eight is bigger than two, six, one, and four, so eight, three, seven, one is the largest. Two, six, one, four, so six is the next largest number, six, six, oh, three. And now we're just comparing two, one, and four. So the next largest is gonna be the four, three, six, three, then the two, five, two, eight, and finally the one, eight, two, five. Um, question number nine, smallest to largest. Now, we need to be careful here with the negative number. So obviously one of these numbers is uh, the smallest. So which, which is it? So which number is the most negative? The most negative number is going to be the, the smallest. Minus 498 is more negative than minus 20. So minus 498 is smaller than minus 20. So we've got these in the correct order. If you're ever struggling with this, just think of your number line zero, minus one, minus two, minus three, minus four. Um, so the numbers are decreasing in value as we go to the left. It does seem confusing because we know that four is bigger than two, but minus four is less than minus two because it's further to the left on a number line. So therefore that's why minus four, nine, eight is lower in value than negative 20. So now we're just comparing five, five, nine, six, oh, eight, and three, five, three. So what's the smallest? Well, the all three digit numbers beginning with a three, a six, and a five, or well, three is the lowest number there. So three, five, three, followed by five, five, nine, and then six, zero, eight. Question number 10, we've got the issue with uh, the negative numbers. So we know that these are definitely the three smallest. Um, so therefore the largest is between 2256 and 3483. So three is bigger than two. So the largest number is 3483. The second largest is gonna be the 2256. And that's probably not gonna cause um, anyone any major problems there. The difficulty is comparing the negative numbers. Now, if you want, you, let's, here's another way you could do it. Let's pretend they're positive numbers. 2991, 1564 and 25. Three, nine. So let's put these in order from smallest to largest. So the smallest number is 1564, followed by 2539, followed by 2991. So they're in order from smallest to largest as if they were, as if they were positive numbers. So uh, smallest to largest as if they were negative numbers would be the other way around. So 1564, smallest, 2991 biggest, therefore minus 2991 is smallest and minus 1564 is the biggest. So it goes in this order now, minus 2991, minus 2539 and minus 1564. Largest to smallest with um, in question 11, well the largest is going to be the positive number with three digits. So 830 followed by 86, that was the easy bit. So again, we might wanna see these as positive numbers. So 777, 748, 303. Let's put them in order largest to smallest as if they're positive numbers. In fact, they are in order largest to smallest as positive numbers. So therefore, in terms of negative numbers, it's gonna be the other way around. So minus 303, minus 748, minus 777. So they're now in order of largest to smallest. Minus 303 is larger than minus 748 because it's less negative and minus 748 is uh, larger than minus 777 again because it's less negative. And finally, question number 12, largest to smallest. So let's just put the positive numbers in order first. Uh, the, the three of them are four digit numbers beginning with a five and eight and a four. So eight is the biggest one. So 8801, 5920, 48, Four, four. Okay, so which is larger? Minus 605 minus 
3015. Well, let's put them in order as if they were positive numbers. So 605 and 3015. So if we're putting them in order, largest to smallest, that would be 3015605. So we've got them in order, largest to smallest as if they're positive numbers. So if you make them negative numbers, it's going to be the opposite order. Minus 605, minus 3015. So therefore, the larger of the two numbers is minus 605. And then minus 3015. And when you think about it, it does make sense that this is the smallest number of them all because this is the most negative.